my dear friends today we will talk about the population of india friends the people are very important component of a country india is now the most populated country of the world india's population is larger than the total population of north america south america and australia put together in india uttar pradesh has the highest population followed by maharashtra bihar and west bengal the total population of india is 142.86 crores with this population india will be the most populated country in the world mumbai's local trains have a daily ridership of 7.58 million that's larger than the population of many countries including new zealand and bulgaria india accounts for 2.4% of the world's total surface area of 3.28 million square kilometer yet it sustains a whooping 17.5% of the world's population in 2013 Kumbh Mela around 120 million devotees attended the event over 2 months that's about the same population as Mexico between 2001 and 2011 India's population growth was even more than Pakistan's entire population currently India is home to 5 mega cities This number is slated to increase to 7 by 2030. A mega city is a city of more than 10 million people. The population of one state of India that is UP alone is more or less the same as that of the entire nation of Brazil. According to one report by the BBC India claims to be the world's second largest English speaking country with 125 million people in the country speaking the language the united states ranks first india is third in the world for billionaires after usa and china the majority of the population in india is hindu that is 80% 15% are muslims 2% sikhs and rest christians buddhists and jains etc there are total 23 official languages while hindi is the most widely spoken language according to the constitution each of the 22 local languages plus english are of equal importance india has an adult literacy rate of 75% Roughly 67% of the world's outsourcing is done in India. The population of India according to their economic status is divided into three groups: main workers, marginal workers, and non-workers. The proportion of main and marginal workers is only 39.8% according to 2011 census. A vast majority of 60% population is non-worker. This indicates an economic status in which there is a larger proportion of dependent population, further indicating possible existence of large number of unemployed or underemployed people.